man, it's Mossy HD7 here, and welcome back to another episode of the Crystal Palace Career Mode. And I told you we'll be back with a banger. We're here with our first game in the FA Cup. We're up against Liverpool, probably the hardest game that we could have got. Well, we could have got City as well, but we beat them in the cup last time, so maybe not. And we beat them in the league as well, so maybe not. We got Liverpool away. Then we've got both the Bournemouth games and the Arsenal game. I'm going to stop it after this Bournemouth game because then we've got a week of you boys to give me some suggestions of who to sign. And um, yeah, I, I need to know who to sign. I don't even know if I can sign anyone, to be fair. We've got 900k. So we're going to move on and we're going to get straight into this game and see if we can do anything against Liverpool. Right then, boys, the game has come thick and span. It's come quick and fast. And I'm going to have to rotate the team because the boys are a little bit tired. And I want to rotate it anyway because it is a cup game. If we don't get through, I'll be a bit gutted because they want the FA Cup. But we could win the Carabao Cup. So, it's not all it's not all doom and gloom. I'll show you what the team looks like once I finish with it. And then, boys, this is what the team looks like. Johnston, Holden, Gendre, Riederwald, Milo, Bargy and Edward all come in. We've got some usual players in there as well. We've got SA is on the bench, so we need him coming off. Mateta, Richard, Raksaki, Water, Munoz, Henderson all on the bench. We've got the boys there. And we need to get this win. So, let's see if we can progress to the next round of the FA Cup. I know that I know I trust these boys, but it's whether they trust themselves. Let's get it! Oh yes, just just to confirm, with four minute halves, difficulty level is on ultimate, competitor mode is on, and play base difficulty is on. By the way, I haven't changed these, and then computer, yeah, 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 yeah. And then it, in, in, the, the, the frequency is on 85. I don't know why I'm talking like this. I just want to prove to you that it's bloody right. Let's do it. And then, boys, at Anfield, for the first time this season, I, feel, I think we beat them at home when we last played them. And the boys have rotated. And I don't think they have much, to be fair, because I can see their normal start in front three there. I can see the midfield. they got Thiago in there as well, who we know... Injured in real life, but he is an absolute baller. So let's see if we can get any sort of result out of this. I'd, I'd like it not to go to a replay, because I don't fancy me chances in a replay. Actually, no, we'll be at home, so maybe we do. Milo, little dink. I don't know why I dinked it. We're at the cop end. Can we get a win? Can we get a win, boys? Lang whips it in. Milo, header. Darwin puts it into the cop. Uh, Robertson's ran into the barriers as well. Started this game off nice. We're going to make them cry like our abbreviation. Allison with another save. I tell you what, corner galore, boys. Corner galore. We're going to put Rooney Bargy on it because he's a left-footed winger. He whips it in. Who's there? Lang. Oh, big verge is there. Ridwald, keep it alive. Uh, Lerma. Hey, I'll give it Milo. Oi. It's like Milo's still there. Take a touch on that, son. What a touch that was, by the way. Through to Lang. Lang, hit it then. Oi. Straight to Allison. But you know what? That's not bad. Come on, then. Lerma, what have you got, mate? Put it there. To Bargy. We're in top form, boys. We can beat anyone. I don't care if we're at Anfield. I don't care if it's against Liverpool. Rooney Bargy running through. Right foot. Oh, he puts it into the crowd. Unlucky, my mates. Unlucky, my mates. Big Mitch. Milo. Come on, then. Wait through. Lang. Bury it, please. It's a goal. How has he missed, man? I said it was a goal because I thought it was a definite goal. How has he actually missed that? He just put it wide like an absolute donkey. Gives it to Robbo. Edward, get there. Oh, you can't be getting done by a Scotsman. You can't be getting done by a Scotsman. <laughs> I don't know what accent that was. Please excuse me. I've got I've got excited levels in my in my system. Please don't tell me. Please don't tell me. Maka, what have you got? Up against Holder. Oh, he's put it in. He's put it in. He's wiggled it round. And he's told us all that he's here to stay. So call him daddy. And that's what we're going to have to do, boys. That's what we're going to have to do because he's done very good. Maka with a goal and we're 1-0 down after we are the team that's actually been playing well and Lang could have um, you know Lang could have put us ahead but he didn't because Lang missed because he's an idioto idioto come on we've got one last chance one last chance before half time Bargy oh, he couldn't give it through to Milo big verge is always there but Gendre again holding again my boys doing well second half we're going to have to up it boys we're actually one this is the first time we've been losing at half time, you know, boys. Unless Rooney Bargy can change it. Unless Rooney Bargy can change that. Lang! Aye! Just as I said, it's the first time we've been losing at half time. No, it's not. No, it's not, because Lang and Rooney Bargy changed that, boys. It's 1 1. 
And we're going straight into halftime, boys. This is an FA Cup draw that everybody wants to see. Come on, you boys. Boys, second half underway. Liverpool are going to get started. We get it back into the game in the very last minute of the, of, the, of the first half. So, I don't want this to go to a replay. So, we need to get a quick goal. Or maybe not a quick goal. We just need to get a goal in this game to hopefully see us bypass Liverpool. And um, it would be an absolute story, that would, wouldn't it? We beat them in the... In the league, three 0 We would then beat them in the FA Cup, and then we just got to beat them once more in the league, and we could be their bogey team. I think we could be everyone's bogey team, to be fair, this season. Lang to Milo, put that over to Mitchell. It's not an, it's not a great, it's not a great pass. I'm not gonna lie, but that's okay. I'll let you off just this one time, mate. And Bargy's going up top. If we can get it through to him, he is up against Verso. We don't want that. But now Edward through, Edward against his oh, French teammate. I think Edward's French. I mean, with a name like that, he's got to be French, hasn't he? And now it's a 2v1. Salah and Nunes versus Rob Holden. They must be dreaming of this. And he shoots with his right, and Johnson makes a very good save. And it's 1-1 still because Johnson puts it out for a corner. 30 minutes left, boys. We need to hold on here. I don't want a replay because we're going to put our... Uh, no! Oh, my God. We're going to put our um, home record at stake. If we play these again. And they're a very good side. You can see here. Because it's still only 1-1. Milo. Through to Mitchell. Give it to Edward. What's Edward got? Bang it Edward. And it's a good save from Allison. He knows how to save a shot. He does know. Why is it always in swingers? Read well. Why is he on it as well? I don't know. But get he rises. We go straight at Allison. Beautiful. Milo. Come on then. Keep it going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Go to Eze now. Eze, bang it. Oh, Van Dijk just blocks it. He's so good at doing that in real life and especially on the game. And here is Diogo Jota, Mr. Reliable when it comes to in front of goal. And it's a great cross into Salah. Johnston, he probably could have caught that, but he pushes it wide. Graven Birch is coming on. It's all happening here, boys. It's all happening. McAllister gives it to Salah. What's Salah got? Oh, it's going to be heartbreak. It's going to be heartbreak. Gehi. Lang. No. No. No, Johnston, what a save. Oh, my God. And then we've given it away. Johnston with another save. Oh, this guy. This guy. Never mind Dean Henderson. Johnston keeping us in this game, man. Mitchell gives it to Lang. Go, Lang. Go. Go. Keep going. Don't stop. Don't stop. He's going to have to. Who's with me? Who's with me? Mateta's with me. Come on. Eze's in there. Turn him, Eze. Beautiful. Eze, bang it. Oh, we've done it in the last minute. We've done it in the last minute at Anfield. And who other than Everetche Eze? Come on, boys. Come on. Hey, this team is unbelievable. Sam Johnson, I want to congratulate you, boy. You made three impeccable saves in the last few minutes there. We've gone up the pitch because of those saves. Mateta gives it to Eze. What a turn that was, right? Eze and Van Dijk through his legs gets the goal. And I tell you what, boys, what a result this is going to be because that whistle's going to go. And we're through to the next round of the FA Cup. Come on, boys. No replay. And once again, we're still winning. This is incredible. Right, boys. So after that game against Liverpool, we get a 2 1 win in the last minute. But my game crashed. So as you can see here in the top right, well, just below me, actually, just down here, it says 3 1 because uh, it crashed. And obviously, we, we'd had it saved before the game. So we've gone back in. And I've simmed it. And we got a 3-1. So the, the score has changed. But you boys saw it. It was a last minute winner. We won 2-1 in the last minute. So we're going to go get the first leg of Bournemouth underway. Then we're going to play Arsenal. Then we've got the final game against Bournemouth. And let's see if we can get into this, the final of the Carabao Cup. I feel like we can. We've got to make some uh, changes though. Because I can already see that Mateta is very, very tired. As is Richards. And Edouard is also tired as well. So I think Wharton's going to come in as a centre-back. We're going to give um, Bargy a go as well. We'll put Raksaki there. Johnson needs to get his place in the team. Riedewald can come in as well. And you know what? Tompkins, you're finally going to have your place there, mate. You're finally going to have your place in the team. Let's get this game underway on Ultimate against Bournemouth. Away from home. First leg. Come on. And right then, boys. Bournemouth are going to get us underway at the... Is it the Vitali? Is that what they're called now? I think that's where they play. But let's try and do it, boys. Let's try and do it. Let's get into the final. And already, we started off with that high press. Do Corey go on then. Slip through Bargy. That's not Bargy, is it? That's Lang. But you know what? That's okay. Out of every team that we could have got, this was probably one of the best ones to get in the semi-final. I feel like we can beat them over one leg, let alone two. 
So let's see. Let's try and get it done in one leg. I'd be happy to get it done in one leg. And then we can just sim the next one, really. Um, that would be beautiful to me. But we, we'll have to see. You never know. Bournemouth might pose us some, uh, some troubles. They might beat us. And then we might have to win the second leg. But, you know, we are away from home as well. So we might struggle today. But we will try our best. We will try our best. Billing, what have you got? Adams. Oh, Ducori, come on. This is a tough game, you know. I can feel it already. I can feel like they're up for it. And they've been hard to break down when we've had the ball. Mitchell, that's fantastic from you, though. Oh, they're through. Philip Billing. What position is he playing? Because he's very high up. Johnston, you can't be getting beat there. Is that a joke? How has he just been beat at his near post by Philip Billing's weak foot? Look at that. That's shocking. Johnston, I've been so happy with you. You're like, you've literally kept us in that game against Liverpool. Um, in the other cup, in the FA Cup. And then you've just done that against me. That is absolutely shambles, mate. I can't believe it. Cannot believe it. Mitchell, come on then. Keep it going, son. Keep it going. Keep it going all the way. All the way. Here it is. Lang. Through to Eze. Go to the edge to Ducore. Might have to hit one here. He doesn't. He gives it to Eze instead. We're just passing it round. Edward, bang it. And that's how we get a good team goal, boys. Come on. Back in it. 1-1. One, one. No point celebrating, mate. No point. Come on, it's just it's just to get us back into the game. But that's what we know we can do when we get our passing going. Ducore to Eze, to Bargy, to Edward. And the keeper goes across, so I go the other way. Bish, bash, bosh. We're back in the game straight away. Just five minutes later as well. That is what you like to see. Instant, instant reply from the boys. I'm going to have to really improve their stamina, boys, because this Gegen Press is making them all tired, especially when we've got a lot of games. But once we've got some better players in, this team's going to be even better. We won't have to rotate as much. But every time we have rotated, the, te the team's done good, to be honest. I'm not going to lie. But we've struggled today in this first half against Bournemouth. But we know what we can do in the second half against them. So come on. Straight back to it, boys. And we're getting underway, which is fantastic. Because that means we keep the ball straight away. And we, we can go and try and get a goal early doors to see us into the second leg. Hopefully... With a winning lead. That would be fantastic. A winning lead. You can't, have a, you can't have a losing lead, can you? That would just be losing. Yes. Beautiful, mate. Corey. Rooney Bargy. What have you got, lad? Give it to Lang. Lang, bang it, please. Oh, he's a great strike. I'm surprised I got through their defender, to be honest. But it's gone into the back of the net. And you can't argue with it. That is absolutely brilliant from Lang. Absolutely brilliant. Look at it. Takes a touch. Bang. How does it go through the defender? It just goes round him. And round the keeper. And we're back in front. Well, not back in front. We are in front for the first time, boys. And you know what? We've, we've taken our time. But apart from Bournemouth's goal, they've literally done nothing to warrant being in the lead or even being in this tie, really. I feel like we've been all over them. We've been having the shots. We've been putting the pressure on. They just got a look, lucky shot with Billing that uh, Johnston should have saved. Big lad. Play Eze. Go on, then. Eze's gone. Eze's gone. My guy. Into the back of the net. Travella. Game done and dusted, surely. Got to be game done and dusted. 3-1 in the 65th minute. I reckon we could get another two here. And um, they're probably going to struggle, Bournemouth, to try and stay in the game. But I know I know what we can do. I know what we can do. So let's keep it up. Might have to rotate in a minute, boys. But this looks like the second leg isn't going to be getting played. And um, the final could be coming soon, boys. I don't know what episode. Maybe the next one or the one after. But we'll, we'll, I'll make sure I show most of the game for that one. Go on then, Mitchell. Go on then. What have you got? Edouard Lav. Ooh, megged. Somehow. Don't come out with the ball though, so you can't really say it's a successful megs. But here is Eze. Wins it back. Very high up the pitch. Come on then, Eze. Put it across. Edward. 4-1. Game done and dusted. We're into the final, boys. There's no way we bottle this. Even with a simmed game, I can't see us bottling it. But who knows? Who knows? I'm just... Ah... Oh. I don't know why I'm picking it. I don't know why I'm picking it because it's going to start bleeding and I'll just keep doing the same thing again. But addictive, boys. It's addictive. Eze wins the ball back, puts it through to Edward, and Edward bangs it into the back of the net. Defo game done and dusted. We were a little bit shaky at the start to concede, but we come back into it. 4 1 against Bournemouth. And this is what I wanted from the first leg. I'm not going to lie. But if we sim the next game, that's going to put our home run under pressure. And I don't want to do that. So we might have to play part of it. And then sim the rest. But I'll, I'll see, boys. I'll see how I'm feeling. But if, if it's a game I don't have to play, because we, I know that we're going to win, then that's okay. Lerma, go on then. Mitchell. Go on then, Mitchell. Go on then. 
One more to Edward again. Edward again is 5-1, boys. Too easy. We'll skip that because the Bournemouth fans that are watching now are probably hating me. They are hating me indeed. But they're definitely out of the Carabao Cup. There's no way they're going to carry on. Um, carry on. They're not going to progress. They're not going to beat us, are they, in the second leg? Milo whip it in. Oh, Raksaki stopped his run. It was a terrible cross anyway, I'm not going to lie. Absolutely shocking cross. Raksaki, come on. Get that press on. Almost over, boys. Almost time. Eze has had a very good game once again. He's got on a score sheet once again. This guy is an absolute baller. Who thinks he could win the Ballon d'Or? You never know. Never know. If we win the league, he could win the Ballon d'Or. Raksaki, go on then. Get a sixth. Get a sixth to embarrass them. Pass it there. Eze, come on then. 6-1. Probably sh <coughs> shouldn't have passed that. Sorry for the cough. I should have just buried it. But we take it. 6-1 in the first leg. Easy, easy game. And let's go take on Arsenal. Then, boys, after that cracking game against Bournemouth where we won, was it 6-1? I think we won. Honestly, this episode has been split up between three separate days because that's all I've had time to record. Uh, we've got Arsenal, which is going to be our last game of the episode. And then we are going to sim the last game against Bournemouth because, obviously, we don't really need to win, play that game because we've already won it. So let's see if we can keep our run up. And then let's go see who we're going to have in the final when we sim that final game. Come on, you Eagles. And then, boys, Arsenal going to get us underway. And let's see if they've made any signings so far. So far, I can't see any. I feel like we, we can smash these. So we've smashed City. We've smashed Liverpool. We've beat Liverpool twice, actually. Um, but I feel like easy win. Easy win against Arsenal. What, what have they got that the other two teams don't have? And then we lose it to Timber, who is injured in real life. So... Nice to see him get some game time. Gliding in there, unlucky. Mitchell, you got to get there, though. Kyle Saka, we know he can be dangerous. He's overrated, but he can still be dangerous. Jesus, oh, come on, keeper. Henderson, you got to be saving that, man. You've got to be saving that. That was way too easy. Look, a few little ball rolls. Predict the shot. No, he just falls on his arse instead. He goes backwards, though. And Mitchell, oh, I was looking at who was in the box. I didn't see Saka running at me. I just knew that the right back wasn't there. Ben White, but Saka came back, made a tackle. And Lang wins it back. I wasn't even controlling him, but we'll take it. And straight away, up the pitch. Eze, come on, cut in. We know what he can do. Ebreche, Eze, unlucky, mate. Up against Saliba. Try and get that. Unlucky, unlucky. Come on, keep it going. Rice gives it to Havertz. Ducore, get in there, son. Get in there, great tackle. Elise. Lerma, Ducore, way through Eze now. Ah, oh, it's a poor pass. They've had a lucky goal at the start, but then since then, we've been absolutely all over them. We need to try and keep it like that, boys. Here is Saka through against Gehi, but Gehi does so well to keep the ball, make the tackle. Elise, interesting pass to Ducore, but you know what? Oh, Richards. That was poor from Richards. Gehi, come on. Great tackle, mate. Great tackle. That's why we can rely on Gehi so much. By the way, boys, I, I didn't uh, show it, but we had an offer from uh, Real Madrid. I think it was Real Madrid, or it might have been Chelsea, for about 30 mil for Gehi. Most likely probably Chelsea. That makes more sense, doesn't it? Because didn't Gehi come from Chelsea? If he didn't, let me know. But I'm pretty sure he did, and that's a typical Chelsea thing to do. Sell someone, and then sign them for even more, because they're idiots. It'll be the first time that we're losing at half-time this season. I don't think we have been once this season yet. Remember in the last... Was it the last game? I said the same thing and then we ended up pulling it back to 1-1. But this time we can't. We are 1-0 down at half time. So we've got a big, big second half against us. On the boys. Second half underway. What can we do? What can we do? Munoz. My guy. In there. Ducori I'll have. Beautiful. Eze. Come on, boys. We need to get back in this now. If we want to stay at the top, Mitchell whip it in. Gets a second bite at it, though, because White gives it in backwards. That's poor from Mitchell. You're so much better at that, but Gehi's there. Don't you worry. Gehi, the man mountain. Mitchell into Ducore. Go and find Mateta, then. Beautiful. Langelav. Back to Mateta, if you can. Go on, then, Mateta. Keep it running. Put it in. Oh, Saliba's there. Oh, Ramsdale comes out for it very, very quickly. When we can't keep the ball. I thought Havertz was on mine then. That was a bit interesting. That shadow threw me off. I thought he was in a fully white kit. But he was in red and white. Well this could be our first loss in a while to be fair. Could be our very... Oh it is as well. It is. 
So another goal for Arsenal. They've just absolutely annihilated me there with some quick passing. And we are going to get a loss today, I think, boys, because we haven't been very good in attack. And the defending hasn't been very good. They've only had two attacks, really, and they've cut through us both times. Henderson not having a good time in net. This is really going to ruin our um, goals against, which I don't want to ruin. So hopefully we don't concede any more. Nice. Great tackle. Lerma into Eze. Through to Mateta then. Come on. Mateta, bang it. Please, there's one back. There's one. Maybe we're not going to lose. Oh, okay. He's just ran into the goal. Fair enough, mate. You're going to have me rubidu mug. Don't know why I just did that, but you know. Come on, let's keep going. We can get a win here. Easily get a win. Declan Rice, what's he got? Kyle Saka. Jorginho. Oh, no, 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 no. Not, not again. Uh, bloody hell. Why can't we defend, boys? So stupid, man. Beautiful, Ducore. I'm going to keep all these boys on because I, I trust them to get me out of this. Mateta, go to Lang. Go on Lang. Inwards. Eze's free now. Eze's still free. Eze, please, come on. Well done. Pick that ball up. We're back in it, boys. It might be a six-goal thriller. It's a five-goal thriller at the moment with 15 minutes left. We can definitely get a win out of this game. I don't think Elise has done much this um, game, to be quite honest with you. But how have we had, I didn't think we'd done more passes than Arsenal, but clearly we've been passing quite well today. Eze, come on, keep going. I'm going to make some quick subs because the boys look a little bit tired. Eze is actually tired, but he's the main man. So right, Milo's got to come on. We'll bring Gendry on as well. We'll leave the rest like that. I know Elise hasn't played very well, but... Um, We'll keep him on because he's got more stamina than Eze and we need the boys to be running with the high press. We need them to be running as fast as they possibly can. Come on then, Lang. Come on then. Keep going. Elise, I need you to run now. He's gone. Who's he up against? Who is he up against? He's up against Timber. Elise, please. Oh, it's a good save from Ramsdale, but it's still alive. Ducore, Lerma. Lerma, one more to Eze. Oh, it's a poor pass, man. The subs aren't going to come on in time, and I think it's going to be a loss, boys. I think it is going to be a loss, unless Lang can play a good ball through to Mateta. No, he can't. If that was more powerful, he was through on goal then. Oh, here we go. Eze, through to Mateta. Please, Mateta! <laughs> we don't get the loss, boys. There is one thing about this Crystal Palace team. We know how to scrape a last-minute goal, and we get a draw. What a bloody, bloody game once again. I, just as I thought I'd messed it up, Arsenal fans must be kicking themselves. They were 2-0 up, then they were 3-1 up, but we win it high just after losing the ball. It wasn't a great ball through to Mateta, but he just pokes at it past Ramsdale. He should probably do a lot better, but he doesn't. And that is going to be game done and dusted. We finally got the subs on, not that it matters now, but that is the game. And we get a 3-3 draw against Arsenal, and I bloody love it, boys. Come on. Let's go sim this game against Bournemouth. And right then, boys, I don't want to rotate the team too much because I want to keep this record up at home. 6-1 on aggregate, definitely through to the final. Let's give it a very quick sim, see if we get a result. We get a 4-2 result. Lerma comes off the bench, not Lerma comes off the bench, Eze comes off the bench and gets two. And we win 10-3 on aggregate. And who does that mean we are playing in the final? Is it going to tell us? I have no idea. We are going to be playing Newcastle in the final, which I think that we could win, boys. Definitely we could win that. Um, also, we've got the next round of the FA Cup coming up, which is going to be in the next episode. When have we got Newcastle at the end? So we'll next episode, we'll probably have Oxford, Sheffield, maybe Brighton and Chelsea. And then the one after, we'll have Everton. And we'll finish off the episode against Newcastle, which is the Cup Final, boys. Cup Final in our first season. Absolutely sensational. Let's finish off by looking at the Premier League. And once again, we're at the top by two points. Our goals against are now level with Aston Villa, but our goal difference is so good because we're scoring lots and lots of goals. Hopefully you've all enjoyed this video. If you have, make sure you leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you turn that notification bell on so you never miss a video. And I'll see you all in a week. Peace.